Hello everyone and welcome to my bold and beautiful today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Steffi's Grave Risk, Luna's Executioner Bomb and Finn Frets. The striking and the wonderful uncover that Steffi Forrester Finnegan is in grave peril. Luna Nozawa makes an exceptional disclosure. Also, John Finn Finnegan will keep worrying about his out-of-control spouse. Thus, we should get everything rolling and discuss what's coming up in the CBS cleanser. Steffi Forrester Finnegan's Grave Risk BNB spoilers for Tuesday, August 27 uncover that Steffi will in any case be secured in an enclosure. Bad guys in this cleanser sure like enclosures, despite the fact that we need to say Steffi's is very bigger than Justin Hairdresser's enclosure was for Thomas Forrester. Back to the ongoing storyline, Steffi is going crazy and which is all well and good. Steffi awakened in an enclosure and has now found that a young lady she trusted is a destructive crazy person. BNB Spoilers, Luna Nozawa's Executioner Bomb Done with Luna, she will keep admitting to Steffi. Since why not, in the event that Steffi will bite the dust, should tell her beginning and end. At any rate, Luna believes that Steffi will meet her producer soon. Fans realize that Steffi is keeping close by and in the end, Luna will get busted. Luna has proactively let Steffi know that she killed Tom Starr and Paul Hollis Hollister. Luna didn't appear to regret it. Presently Luna thinks about Steffi and intricacy. Thus, Steffi will figure out that Luna plans to take a third life. Steffi's Destruction Risk the strong and the wonderful uncover that Steffi could let Luna know that somebody will see as her. In any case, Luna will illuminate Steffi that the structure will be crushed. When anybody understands Steffi is missing, she will be a distant memory. Nonetheless, Luna is underrating the force of adoration. The strong and the lovely. In Tuesday's episode, fans will likewise see Finn keep on overreacting about his significant other. The more extended that Steffi goes without reaching Finn, the more stressed he will get. Finn could try and reason that Steffi could never go days without investigating her kids. While Edge Forrester and Brooke Logan don't appear to be concerned, they could come to think twice about it. Can Finn demonstrate his value and save Steffi? What's the significance here when Luna at last gets busted? What will that mean for Luna's mom, Penelope Poppy Nozawa? Which storyline would you say you are anticipating seeing the most on Tuesday, August 27, 2024? Luna's Frigid Disclosure, Bill's New Sensation, Finn Oddities Out. The Striking and the Wonderful is at last in. On Monday's episode, Steffi Forrester Finnegan awakens in an enclosure. Luna Nozawa confesses to killing two men and outlining her mom. Also, John Finn Finnegan goes nuts to Edge Forrester and Brooke Logan. Penetrating Meeting On Monday, BNB showed haziness with simply the sound of penetrating. A couple of bolts are heard dropping. Then, at that point, the camera begins to blur in some light, which shows the external edges of the enclosure. Steffi is inside the enclosure, lying on her side in a caramel-shaded suit. The suit matches the enclosure style. Luna is occupied with penetrating endlessly. Steffi begins to awaken, her hand goes to the side of her sanctuary. Steffi's vision is blurring in and out. Steffi turns over and returns to rest and Luna taps the lock shut. Luna doesn't seem as though she really regrets this by any means. Finn is in the chief office at Forrester Manifestations. Finn is yelling about Steffi going MIA. Finn tells Edge and Brooke that Steffi asked him not to reach her and she'll be in contact. Finn says it's anything but a positive sentiment, not knowing where your better half is. Luna is as yet boring. Steffi begins blending once more. Steffi is confounded and peers at the drill a couple of moments prior to nodding off once more. BNB Recap, Katie Logan's Help Katie Logan needs to show up for Bill Spencer. Bill lets Katie know that he's giving Luna his full help as she's lost everything. Katie is befuddled as Luna actually has R.J. Forrester and the occupation at Forrester Manifestations. Katie raises everyone individuals who care about Luna. 
Katie likewise reminds Bill that if Penelope Poppy Nozawa is blameworthy, the young lady should visit her mom in jail. Bill removes Katie and reasons another person might have carried out the homicides. Katie needs to know who as Poppy had an open door and rationale. Katie additionally says Poppy was frantic to clutch her existence with Bill. Bill says the Poppy that he knew, that he assumed he knew, then he stops. Katie is curious as to whether Poppy is out of his life now. Bill says that he's actually handling all of this and hasn't gone with any choices yet. Bill is approaching things slowly and carefully. Katie offers to address Will Spencer about him done having a sister. Bill wishes Luna had a sibling to help her through this. Bill says Luna is the guiltless casualty in all of this. Finn makes sense of he needed to enlighten Steffi regarding the kiss. Finn realizes that insider facts obliterate relationships and he won't allow that to happen to his relationship. Finn says he will constantly be straightforward with Steffi. Finn then discusses how Steffi cautioned him to avoid trust, yet he didn't tune in. Finn hammers himself for assuming the best about everybody. Brooke says that trust isn't generally this way. Regularly, trust doesn't circumvent kissing wedded men, Brooke demands. Finn vents over how trust confounded kinship and dream. Finn is pretty ticked off and he's getting madder every moment. Finn says he never conveyed conflicting messages with trust, yet presently he couldn't say whether Steffi is even okay. Once more, Steffi awakens. This time, she sits up to the extent that she can in that enclosure and glances around. Steffi sees Luna through the enclosure bars. Right away, Steffi asks Luna for help. Luna says nothing or move. Steffi asks where she and occurred. The enclosure is in the front room of the loft, similar to it's a household item. Luna doesn't stash her casualty in a room or wardrobe, goodness. As Steffi gradually squints, Luna walks forward and backward, glaring down at the enclosure. Luna actually isn't uttering a word. This certainly adds to the frightening energy. Charge Spencer's promise. The striking and the lovely recap for Monday, August 26th uncovers that Bill thinks Luna is taking care of the circumstance well, despite the fact that it's simply been a couple of days. Katie credits Bill for that. Charge promises to show up for Luna. Bill says he welcomed Luna to remain there as long as she wants. Katie says that can't continue for eternity. Katie raises RJ's remark about Luna being there for Bill. Katie raises that RJ referenced Luna truly cherishes Bill. Bill streaks back to the kiss. Finn tells Edge and Brooke that Steffi is his reality, his life. However, Finn simply continues to hurt her. Finn makes sense of the kiss was the straw that broke the camel's back for Steffi. Edge doesn't have any idea. Finn says they've been managing a great deal. Finn goes through the Sheila antics and how he let her get excessively close. Finn said exactly the same thing occurred with trust. Brooke raises that is the sort of man Finn is. Finn could do without Steffi being gone and him not in any event, knowing where she is. Edge attempts to console Finn, yet he's plainly disappointed over his choices. Steffi needs to know where she is. Luna says the structure is going to crash down. Steffi holds her head as she attempts to stand up in the enclosure. Luna said the impacts would wear off soon. Steffi before long understands that she was sedated. Steffi requires a moment before she understands she's secured in an enclosure and Luna is the bad guy. Steffi begins banging and shouting, asking to be let out. The striking and the delightful. Bill and Katie are contacting hands. Bill values the amount Katie cares. Bill calls her a heavenly messenger, thus substantially more. Katie discusses the number of individuals that adoration Bill. Katie concedes that she adores Bill, as well. They embrace as tears tumble down Katie's cheeks. Brooke and Edge get some information about the children. They are covered, Finn says. Edge advises Finn to give it a couple of days and on the off chance that there's still no word from Steffi, they'll follow through with something. Yet again Finn says he didn't actually kiss trust back as he's focused on Steffi. Finn adores his family and what they build. Edge puts his arm around Brooke's midriff as Finn talks. Finn maintains that Steffi should return home. 
Steffi needs their life back pre-Sheila and pre-Trust. Finn simply has to realize that Steffi is all right. Steffi requests to understand what Luna is doing. Steffi reviews Luna kissing Bill. Steffi says Bill is family to her. Luna abruptly lets completely go and says her mom is in prison for killing two men. Luna says her entire world fell and Bill was there for her. Steffi counters back, that is the way in which you show appreciation? By kissing him? Luna raises that Steffi said they are not generally related and are grown-ups. We don't recollect Steffi saying precisely that, however all right, Luna. Steffi reminds Luna that Bill is with her mom. Luna expresses, not for a really long time, not when a jury convicts her. Steffi is sickened over Luna placing her own mom in jail so she can accompany a man. Steffi's brain is blown. Mine is also. Steffi pushes fuming and hollering about how Luna isn't alone to pull off it. Luna shouts back, I've pulled off it up to this point. Luna says, I killed both Paul Hollis Hollister, Hollis W. Chambers, and that bum Tom, Star, Clint Howard, and you are not mentioning it to anyone. Luna's chilling disclosure, Finn's wild-eyed frenzy. The intense and the delightful are here. On the upcoming episode, anticipate that Steffi Forrester Finnegan should keep going nuts over her cagey circumstance. Coming up on the intense and the delightful. While Steffi scrambles to sort out some way to get away, Luna Nozawa makes an incredible admission. Furthermore, John Finn Finnegan starts agonizing over Steffi. Continue to peruse and we should discuss what's coming up. The striking and the lovely Steffi Forrester Finnegan can find. BNB uncover that Steffi will.